Hey everybody, I'm going to do a uh, quick video here on how I check projector lamps if they are sent back for an alleged timer issue. Now, these are ETL 8060Ws that are used in a, a bunch of Panasonic projectors. They have a timer module on them. And uh, occasionally, um, we get complaints that the timer's not showing up right, something like that, or the projector shuts down because of a timer. So I have this uh, DZ570U projector. I think I've had this in other videos. Uh, but I've modified it so that the connector for the timer is actually hanging out the side. Normally you have to open the back up, take the lamp out, it actually plugs in like that. This is only a single lamp projector, so I have to check one at a time. But rather than opening it up, having to go back and forth, I moved the uh, timer wire out the side. I just cut a little notch in the plastic. And I have a, a known good lamp assembly in there. So that also means I don't have to worry about these getting hot. So all I have to do to test it is I take off the, uh, the known good chip that's actually for the lamp that's in there. Just set that on top. Then I get the connector, and I just plug it in here. Now, the way these are designed, the connector actually can go either direction. It can go this way. Actually, I'll show you with this one. It can go that way, or it can go that way. It doesn't matter, because how the pins are set up, it connects properly either way. So, for this, we'll plug it in there. And then I need to turn the power on to the projector. So when I turn on the mains power, it actually queries the chip and makes sure that it's connected. That's one of the ways it can tell the lamp is installed. They should go off and that should go solid red. Then I'll press power. That'll go green. Color wheel fires up. Lamp inside fires up. And now let's look at the picture. Um, I don't have a signal plugged in, so let's get into the menu. And we'll go down to... Oh, crud, where is it? Projector setup, I think. Status. Yeah, that's what we want. And there we go. Yeah, that timer has one hour on it so that projector lamp did run for about an hour before it was sent back um, you can see my total run time on this projector is over 12,000 hours I've used this thing to test the heck out of things so that one chip is good so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it off I'll plug the other lamp in from the twin pack and we'll see if this one does the same thing so while the internal lamp is cooling down this one's perfectly fine so I can just unhook it. I'm going to put a little mark and that means that this one's been checked in a projector. So let's get the other one. We'll get that ready. Now I don't know if it makes a difference but I don't plug these in until after the fan shuts off. I don't I don't want to confuse things. The projector is not expecting the timer to change unless the door switch is opened and that's not going to happen here so instead I wait for the fan to turn off I kill the mains power plug that in and then fire it back up so let's put this one away because I know this one's fine so I'll put that back in the bag oh actually this is using an Osram bulb so these are great the Osram actually made a really nice fair lamp for these. I, uh, Osram's not high on my favorite lamp manufacturer list, but they definitely got these right. The uh, Matsushita OEMs uh, are also fine if you can find them. They don't really make them much anymore. Here's an OEM. HS300 AR124. It's a 300 watt bare lamp. And then you can see the Osram replacement. They did a real good job. The reflector shape's the same. I mean, this one's worn out and old. That's why it's great, you know, uh, foggy in there. But they run really well. So 
So I'm going to wait for the fan. To, oh, I thought it was going to turn off. I'm going to wait for that fan to turn off, and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, so the fan turned off. Kill the mains power. LED went off. There we go. Plugged in. Correct standby and power. Setup and status. Okay, so this side ran for four hours. That's curious. I wonder how they got one hour and four hours. Very unusual, unless they were also in a single lamp projector, but I don't think so. But either way, it's clearly working. The timers are being read. There's nothing wrong here. So these aren't trash, but I'm definitely going to keep them around for something. Um, but I'm going to contact the customer now and let them know that the uh, lamps that they thought were bad are actually perfectly fine, and they uh, probably need to get their projector checked out. So maybe we'll see a dual lamp Panasonic on the channel soon. Either way, if you got this far, thank you for watching.